my name is Stig Ubusa. I'm the park owner together with my brother of Under. It's the world's largest underwater restaurant and the first in uh, Europe. But it's much more than just that. The challenge was really to find a form and a shape and a location that could actually withstand these forces that we knew were coming. So the solution was a pipe. And it was uh, constructed on a barge, then transported to this site and carefully lifted off the barge onto its very precise foundation points. Because a big issue is, of course, not to ruin the place while you're constructing. So it had to be put down in a really careful manner in order to maintain the landscape and the underwater landscape, not the least, not to ruin the ecology of the place. So once that was done, everyone was breathing out. That was the real most challenging part of the project. try to uh, show uh, what the south part of Norway can be and is. Most people, they don't know what is under the water in the Nordic seas. It's totally different from the trop tropical fishes with uh, the colors. It's different. We have the, the brown, the green, the red seaweeds. So yeah, we think also in our cold waters we have spectacular colors. The head chef, Nikolai, he's been working on the menu now for one and a half year, just working with it and foraging and uh, exploring new ways uh, of using different uh, variety of the sea. In the mornings I like to go out and forage for different kinds of things. Right now, at this time of year, it's mostly seaweed. I think it's so nice to tell the guests that this uh, sorrel we forage just out here, 150 meters from the restaurant. There's so many things that are not getting used. Everybody wants um, only the best ingredients, but why can't a uh, lingro not be good? It's definitely better for the environment if people eat the things next door instead of having fluid in foie gras and truffle every day. Some days you will get a lot of fish and some days it's not that good. That's how nature is. It's not the, uh, not, nothing more, nothing less. It's nature at its best. Mm -hmm.